that's what I'm doing with that seat. I'm telling you, I've never, I can tell you, I haven't ridden once with that seat. I can't even tell you what it feels like. I'm not interested. Brutus, you happy? Man, you better be happy. Well, it's a beautiful sunny Sunday here in Sydney. Gorgeous weather, check that out. Absolutely stunning, we've been longing for this. Time to test out the Saddleman SDC, step up seat. San Diego Customs, we're gonna check it out. We're going for a ride, about two hours. I'm gonna go and catch up with my dad and his partner for coffee, which I'm really looking forward to. Haven't seen them for ages. We're gonna get about four hours on the bike. Let's go and check this seat out. What a beautiful day here in Sydney. Absolutely gorgeous. We're probably sitting at around about 19, 20 degrees. Should warm up to probably about 20, probably early 20s, I'd say, about 22 degrees today. And uh, a couple of very light, fluffy clouds in the sky, but otherwise it's absolutely gorgeous. So what are we doing today? We're testing out the, uh, the Saddleman Step Up San Diego Customs, the SDC seat. As you guys know, I have the, uh, the other one we talked about, the, the, the tan and black one, uh, which I did as part of the build on the bike, and I, I absolutely love that seat. It's beautiful, absolutely gorgeous, and actually quite comfortable. It's just that I found, you know, my, my lower back, I was getting a bit of tailbone issues going on, uh, you know, when I'd be on the bike for more than an hour, and, uh, you know, that just doesn't cut it. Not for me, but you know, look, you know, some other guys aren't having these problems, so you know, I don't know if it's just me or what's going on. There are a few videos out there with guys reporting it, but you know, for the best part, a lot of people talk that seat up, you know, and it is a beautiful seat. But uh, so I didn't want to change the style, and that's when you know, I read, a, I saw a review on this SDC uh, seat from San Diego Customs. It's obviously they've taken settlement seat and said, look, give it a give it across to us. Let us put our touches on it. Let, let us change it up a bit. So a bit more gel, a bit more foam, a bit more slander. We're going to put about four hours riding on the bike today. Uh, the destination I'm riding to, I've got about 150 kilometres each way. Uh, so somewhere in the vicinity of about 100 miles each way. And uh, that should give me a pretty fair, you know, feeling about the seat. I've done a couple of little round town rides on it. And I'm very, very impressed so far, but I just didn't want to call it too soon. You know, they also say that, um, you know, riding the seat in this whole 500 mile thing, and, and I'm sure that seats do get more comfortable over time, uh, but I've got to be frank, it is nice to hop on a seat that you enjoy from the get-go, especially when you pay, you know, a lot of money for these seats. These seats aren't cheap. But here's the problem, I'm not happy. I'm not happy with the seat. So what am I happy about? I'm not happy about the comfort. So I've gone out, I think the biggest day ride I've done on that seat's about 400 kilometers, so probably about 250 miles uh, as a day trip, 250, 280 miles as a day trip. And uh, I came back with a busting sore, sore butt. I'm, I've got to tell you, I had a really sore bum after that, that, that particular ride. To the point now where when I'm even on the bike and I'm doing, you know, even a one, one and a half hour ride, I could be riding an hour either way somewhere and then coming back, I will start to get uh, just at the top of my tailbone, a little bit of pain right there. And I'm hoping, I've got a fix and I'm gonna share it with you, but I'm hoping it is the right angle in that seat because it is actually literally almost a right angle. You know, I don't know where you come from, but my butt certainly is not designed like that. My butt into the, it's not really, right? We are rounded. So, you know, we're on the, the hunt for the, for, the, for the forever right seat, as they say, and it is personal. Absolutely, you know, we're all different shapes and sizes, so seats are personal. I mean, have a look at this. This is the seat that comes out on the ST. This is the stock seat that came on the bike. Now, I've got to tell you, with the greatest respect to Harley Davidson, and I, you know, I love Harley Davidson, you guys know that. But with the greatest respect to Harley Davidson with this seat, it's almost like they put this on the bike saying, uh, it's almost like a tag that you pull off a product before you use it. That's how I feel with this seat. 
to be quite frank. It's like, don't ride with it. We're just gonna put it on there, sell the bike to you so you guys can work out what you wanna buy. So a little bit disappointed there. Just the quality of the seat, I've gotta be frank, really, really cheap. It feels cheap. You know, the, the, the plastic molding in the back here, just the, the way it's stapled. I mean, it's just, I, I don't know what I was expecting, but it is cheap. And the finish on it is just, that's what I'm doing with that seat. I'm telling you, I've never, I can tell you, I haven't ridden once with that seat. I can't even tell you what it feels like. I'm not interested. So that's been on the bike since. And I'm gonna tell you, it is a comfortable seat. When you remove the tailbone thing, right, it actually, I know that might sound funny, but it actually is. It's a gel core seat, as Saddle will tell you, and it is actually a very comfortable seat. So it's not so much the bumps, it does take the absorption of the road, it does a bunch of that stuff, and it is comfortable. It's just the angle for me. There's plenty of videos out there, people are loving this step-up seat. You know, it is a comfortable seat, it's just that right angle. Here's the fix I've got. And I love Saddleman products. I'm not sponsored, this is all bought by me, I've got to tell you right now, so this is not a sponsored ad. This is pretty much a step up, but this is their, what they call their uh, San Diego custom seat. However, what is the difference? See this? We have a curve instead of that direct right angle that you can see over there, and I'm gonna get the camera over there in a minute so you can have a look at it a bit closer as to what I'm talking about. But we have a curve in here, which is a little bit more about how our, our bodies are shaped, right? So, uh, beautiful, beautiful seat. I've got to tell you, the, 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 the quality of workmanship that comes out of Saddleman, A+. Plus. You, you cannot put them down. Look at this. All carpeted, riveted, sealed beautifully. Look, I can't just find this thing that I've filled out. Look. Look at the difference. Really? Come on. Anyway. Look at the quality of this seat, amazing. I mean, all their seats are like that. This one's got like a carbon fiber finish. It's got a backrest. I'm gonna show you when I've got it on the bike. I haven't put this on the bike yet, but uh, hopefully this guy's gonna be the fix. All gel as well, so gel inserts and all that. I think this guy's got some foam or more foam or something in there with the gel as well. So really, really good reviews that I've seen on that. But hopefully this is gonna be the fix. Let's get on the bike and check it out. I'm just gonna show you that right angle very quickly before I pull this one off. So just before I pull it off, if I'm coming in here, you'll be able to see what I'm talking about. See this guy here? Look, it's literally just like a bomb, bomb, bomb. Should be happy i think this is what i'm talking about look at this it just looks so awesome look at this backrest who would have thought i would have been riding with a backrest i just sat on this with the backrest and then without the backrest and it's nothing it just comes straight off right you can take it off if you don't want it there's a patch that goes over this with the sdc you put it in there and it just clicks straight in like that it's got about three different settings so as you can see, it sort of bumps you forward depending on where you want to sit in the bike and your comfortability, your pin to lock it in. Uh, for me, it's definitely going to be all the way down is where I'm going to have it. Uh, but like a carbon fiber finish, it's got, they call it a pro gripper. You can feel the grip 
you know, even my, my, my fingers just pushing that. It's actually moving the bike. It's amazing. Very grippy. Uh, this is what I was after, was this, this nice curve here in the back, which I think is where that tailbone issue was coming from. And I've got to tell you, personally, I love the look of this. I think that actually completes the seat. It looks really, really nice. It almost looks a little naked without it. It sort of finishes it off. And it's a point of difference. It's a style design. It looks great. And it has great functionality too. So there's the first 150 k's and uh, yeah, I'm loving this seat. Let me tell you, worlds apart for me, worlds apart. Really, really happy, so comfortable and zero bum, zero bum sore for me, which is great. It's amazing that little backrest just in the, in the lower back part, uh, it just is so securing just keeping your position there in the bike and uh, yeah, I actually think it looks really cool, but it, it's so functional. Uh, you know, I just can't uh, talk too much about its functionality. It actually makes such a massive difference just in supporting that lower back. So, so yeah, on the return journey now, so 150 k's back home. Wow, that was a beautiful, comfortable ride. I gotta tell you, that's my new seat. That's all I got to say, really. And obviously the seat's only going to get better from here uh, as you know I start to run that seat in and uh, it starts to bed in and, and get more comfortable as time goes on but very happy just punched out probably just under 400 kilometers and uh, no sore bum very comfortable and I can't go on about that backrest check it out guys the uh, the San Diego Customs design step up seat from Saddleman and San Diego Customs. What a great seat. No plug, paid for it for myself. No sponsorship there. I, uh, I'm just looking for the for the right seat. I'm just looking for the right seat to share with you guys. So, so I, you know, guys, I, I've got to be frank, I could have kept going, you know, very, very comfortably today. Uh, probably could have done another 200 Ks, I reckon. So, you know, probably another 120, 130 miles, very, very comfortably, you know, maybe even more. Uh, I can't say that it's going to replace my touring seat. You know, that hammock seat, that big uh, guy, as ugly as it is, is just, um, you know, I, I think the thing is doing it one day and then doing it day after day after day when I'm on tour. So I think that's why my, my hammock seat's definitely my go-to uh, when I'm doing, you know, thousands of you know, miles or Ks in the seat. Uh, but you know what, the confidence that I've got from this guy now to be able to do really long day rides in comfort, Overnighters, you know, even a two or three day ride, totally, totally fine. Uh, massive difference. This backrest, this guy here, this, this, what I'm talking about uh, earlier in the video, that, that, that nice slope in the back of the seat, you know, world, worlds apart. You can change the stitching if you want to order it and you want to wait, you can do that. It'll take you a couple of months to get it, depending on where you are in the world. I think even you guys in the States have been waiting a couple of months for these uh, tailor ordered saddleman seats. Uh, you know, they're, they're building them from scratch and I think there's a bit of a backlog happening. I was fortunate enough to pick this guy up uh, out of the US, you know, all black on black, which is fine, suits the bike, you know, so that's really what I wanted. Um, but yeah, really, really happy. So that's my new round town seat, my day riding seat, my overnight seat. And Hammock, you can't see it on camera, he's up there looking at me. Uh, he's going to be coming on tour with me. So we'll catch you soon. I appreciate you watching the video. I hope it was helpful and uh, we'll catch you real soon. You'll be safe. Take care. So